We needed another car or two, and so we're headed out towards a secret location to pick up a uh, C7 Z06 with a built motor and a pro charger and uh, built trans and a pro charge Copo Camaro as well. So we're, we're gonna go get some crazy stuff and uh, we'll see what happens with it. But we gotta go, we gotta unload this one first and see what happens for sure. For sure. So, road trip coming soon. gonna buy a drink and I'm gonna buy a snack so I'm worth about 15 bucks <laughs> Steve on the other hand has a beef jerky addiction that yeah. at like I think what what's a bag of beef jerky like 12 bucks now yeah. uh, Steve's gonna go in here and get me for at least 40 bucks Bobby Hill over here is probably gonna get me for somewhere around 30 or 40 bucks I mean me and you're gonna be the cheapest one <laughs> like me and you're gonna be the cheapest one <laughs> to a Bucky's and it, they will drive out of the way. We go on a trip, they will literally drive out of the way to go to a Bucky's just to see if we can hit the daily limit <laughs> on the debit card. 
Come on. No. No. Go. 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 <laughs> Sneak behind the counter so he could just start taste testing everything. Man. We ain't waiting on Steve. He got his own debit card. <laughs> he always gets round objects to eat for some reason. <laughs> I had to make him put the sausage on a stick down a while ago. <laughs> he tries to swallow it whole. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> we need, you need to get that. No, I do not. Yeah, no. <laughs> Dang. Like your I cousin. Your little cousin. Yeah, I know. You don't like it? No, it looks like a step. Color on both? No, it looks like a step. Let me see. Here we go. Does it look like a fit? It's like a onesie. No. 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 <laughs> Let me say 45. For what? Oh, I was close. I, I bet close. Steve's doing that by himself. You, you, you stay 45. Oh, it's 45. Oh, it's look 40. at you. Oh, yeah, oh, I, I like it. I was close. I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah that one's when you tap it. Fucking Steve get in the damn truck, fucking throw like eight dollars and fucking loose change in the goddamn door pocket and go driving down a bumpy ass road. No. Just a hey, yeah. did you, have you seen this truck today? No, I didn't even look at it. He cleaned it out yesterday. Yeah, I'm sure. I bet. I bet he found. But that's why you're buying everything today. You found like thirty-seven thousand dollars in change in your doors. <laughs> God, dude, I can't even drive that truck. That's like Bobby's fucking work truck. I can't even get in that stupid thing. Bobby Hill. Good to meet you, Bobby. His name is really Nick. We just call him Bobby Hill. He looks like a kid off the Kind of does, doesn't it? Yeah. Now, you know Steve always on his damn phone. Oh, yeah. I miss this car. That's a pretty car. I wonder who's that is. Taste feel, feel, feel. showed him he's like wait a minute what <laughs> it, was, it was an hour we stood there and talking to that man yeah, you take it down the road if you want to i'm not it is it's ready to roll Get on the bridge, I'll probably roll it like half throttle. Okay. I ain't trying to 
wreck this thing. <laughs> Steve test drive it though because yeah. you know when Steve yeah. test drives something he'll let me know if it's worth it or not. Yeah. Now yeah. we got to keep him out of it. Yeah. That's the problem. <laughs> yeah. Now we got to keep him out of it. Yeah. Otherwise I'll never get to drive it. For sure. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. that's what I'm gonna try to do. I, I, I hear this car right here is is uh, available or maybe it's not. Maybe it's already bought. Who knows? Maybe it's a secret. Oh yeah. Dude, it, it, I, you know the the shot that did work. This one's gonna piss the world off, is what it's gonna do. So, a Copo Camaro is a factory built race car, basically. So, it is a factory built, and it's like a holy grail kind of car. What did they come out originally? 67 or 68? Yeah, 67. So, 67, Chevrolet decided to do a factory type race car, and they called it a Copo, which is what does it stand for? Central Office of Production Order. There you go. Hold on. Nope. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Wrong. Come here. Wrong. We need the information. Wrong. So back then, you could go to a dealership and say, I want this car, but I want that motor in it. And you mm -hmm. go open your pamphlet catalog mm -hmm. and go, It's called I a want pamphlet, not a pamphlet, by the way. There's no F in that motherfucking word. Listen. I'm just saying. I just want to make sure we all are on the same page. He put an F in that word, and there's no F in there. Pamphlet. Basically, you go to the dealership and say, I want this car, but I want this motor in it. Yeah. And Copo was the central office of production order. They would allow that to happen, and then hence it was a Copo vehicle because it wasn't a production vehicle at that point. Yep. Mm. So the newer ones, when they came back out in what? I think 10 or 11. Yeah, so they started offering them they again. Those were naturally it. aspirated, weren't they? Uh, yes, yeah, both. Naturally, yeah. You, There's two models. Yeah, you can. They're actually like four now. Now, yeah. But when yeah. they first came back, they were just an NA car built basically yeah. for the NHRA type stuff. And then stuff. in fifteen, they started having the supercharged model. Right. Yeah. So what you could do is you could just like that drag pack that he's got, you could order this car, and as soon as it came in, it was certified to go take it and run an NHRA full circuit with this car, just mm. like it sits. And there's a specific class what it fits, and they're all identical basically. So it's like mm. a NASCAR situation for yeah. drag racing. Nothing. There's not even a vent on these cars. Mm -hmm. No. There's and no so a certificate of origin when you yeah. buy these. Yep. So mm -hmm. the guys that have these, because they're very rare, you don't touch them. You don't change nothing because if yeah. you change anything on it, you can't go run it. It's no longer certified. It's no longer legal. Mm -hmm. Nothing. Well, then you have someone like this man. <laughs> Who yeah. decided a great idea would be to buy a Copo, which is like a holy grail car, yeah. take the motor out of it, set it on the side of his shop, put a built motor in it, and then figure <laughs> out how to hang a pro charger that's not even designed for this on the side of this motor. Please and so we, we fabricate and duct tape a... In, I mean... When people find out what he did with this car, they're going to come looking for him. There's going to be certain Dale Jr. loving fucking race fans that are going to come looking for Lucas. So we're putting him in the witness protection program, and that's why I'm buying everything. So there's your, there's your thumbnail. I had to buy all of Lucas' stuff because he's got to go into witness protection because he fucking tore apart a Copo. This will be a fun car to mess with because it's going to... It's gonna make a lot of people turn heads. Yeah, it's it's, it's bad, man. Like... Got plenty of power too, huh? <laughs>
traction whatsoever because I was sitting there and it was just moving. Just so you know, sorry State Farm, you're going to need to stay here. <laughs> when you put no this people. and this together, that's not a great combination. It probably detects that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, I need to know where the cops are because I'm driving safe and saving. That doesn't fucking go together. So, um, so Lucas and I were having a conversation around his... Uh, GM product that he is not going to make people very happy with, okay? Um, and so with that conversation, it brought up another conversation because, you know, he's got some Mopar stuff and we're boys with Chris Bailey, right? Like, we love Chris Bailey. Yeah. And, you know, we talked a lot of shit with Chris Bailey about certain things. Always. About swapping some things, right? So we had talked about Coyote swapping a Hellcat and Hellcat swapping a Coyote car. Lucas just so happens to say, hey, I got the perfect candidate. It's four-door. He said, a four-door? I said, what? He goes, I got a charger right over there. It's ready to be swapped. And I went, I got a fucking Steve. <laughs> so this is where we're at now. Um, so we're going to go look at his blue charger Hellcat that is ready to be motor swapped. And I just so happen to know a guy that's got a... Short block that's ready to be put together eventually, and we just need a set of heads, and we can Coyote Twin Turbo swap a blue charger, and could you imagine what happens there? Oh my god. <laughs> and then what we do is we show up to the track with his pro-charged Copo to piss the world off, and then we show up with a Coyote swapped Hellcat to piss the world off, and me and Lucas get shot before we leave. I mean, that's just what happens. And so, I think we should just ask Great. This is probably Chris texting me right now going, are you speaking about me? <laughs> <laughs> it's not. Should we call him? No. Oh. <laughs> he's probably staring at my new nan right now. That's what he's doing. He staring might be more me. than staring. Yeah, he might be touching he's him. Broke. <laughs> <laughs> Um, hi. <laughs> um, I'm here with one of your customers, Mr. Mr. Kirkpatrick. I'm currently picking up his red Z06 with the Pro Charger on it to piss the internet off. Yeah. So, remember when you and I had a discussion about breaking the internet with certain few things? Yeah. Mm-hmm, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I was gonna get you a gay pride Mustang to put a Hellcat motor in, and then I was gonna get some kind of a like fat girl car to put a Coyote in, right? Yeah. So we're standing here, and I'm talking to Lucas, and we start talking about you, and I was like, yeah, me and Chris are gonna do this, this, and this, and he goes, ooh, come here, let's go look. He has a blue Charger sitting here that needs a motor. I think we should do it, Chris. And I just so happen to have a built short block with a twin turbo kit that's, you know, gay pride flag on it for coyotes that I think would do really good in there. You in? Yeah. Done. There we go. All right, we're going to go look at it and we'll send you pictures. 12 seconds later. <laughs> It's just a parts car. Yeah, parts car. Motor's out of it. What, $70,000 parts car? Yep. Mm. 
Yeah. What the it's fuck? There. You know how much fun that would be? It's I'm there. Look, it says like, did we just get rid of another car? He's like, stop. No, mm -hmm. I, I need to make room. Let me. Let me make room. For so let me make some room first. I'll get a whole nother shop. I'll lease it tomorrow. Tim's gonna love you. Tim already <laughs> loves me. I got three shops. And every day I call him every week. Hey man, we need this. Hey man, he's like, God dang, Spilled. What needs to happen? We gotta unload that and get it in the shop. I have to get the detail guy out here. So in order to get this done, I'm gonna need to take pictures of it. So you'll have to take the C8 home, and I'll have to take that home. <laughs> You're gonna get to drive it all the way I don't back. I want to drive a Corvette. Okay, you take the truck out here. You take the truck. <laughs> I'll take this. Why? I don't like that. Hmm. I'm about to pull the boss card out of my wallet. I'm about to call your boss. No, no. I'm calling See, HR. I'm calling legs. HR. Jessica, Steve won't let me play. <laughs> You'll get to drive it two hours, and then when we get back, you take the C8, and I'll show Jessica what I want. Probably. Yeah, I'm gonna need that. Yeah, I think. Steve, this is I'll have a hand. How about y'all? Hey, hey, Josh. Y'all rock, paper, scissors to see who go best two out of three on rock, paper, scissors. It's uh, rock, paper, I got the keys you saw. Wait, no, look. Hey, one run. That's cheap. And it's rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Not like Rochambeau 30. I got my gun. One shot. Hey, one shot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Jesus, I went. Oh, yeah. Give me the key. <laughs> Give me the key. Okay. There was no. You want to flip a coin? No, I got a trick for that one too. Play like cards. You want to you want to flip coins? Nope. I got that one too. I learned that trick one time from a guy in jail. He flipped a coin. He's like, he said something about. Uh, what, heads, it, it, I win. Tails, you lose. No, no, no. It was like heads, heads, win, heads up, up or. I gotta, I gotta find that. It's it, Brian. It's heads I win, tails you lose. That's no, right. no, no, it's, yeah. it's heads if it lands on the ground. If it, uh, yeah, something like that. He told me about it. Something about heads on the ground or something. I'll look it up here in a minute. It's heads like on the ground. Dude, that Cadillac's just fucking sick. Uh, you know, I'm gonna vote for getting uh, Jessica Cadillac V. That's Quay V. Okay, done. <laughs> Trade in range. But I gotta rubber. take that home to show her what it'll feel like. So fuck you. Nope. Tomorrow. Oh, oh here we go. You fucking motherfucker telling me what to do. Hey, who's the boss here? Yes, Daddy. Where the fuck are we going? Uh, the hood, I guess. I don't know. This is crazy. Yeah. This ain't the way came. Hey, you know this motherfucker got an LME motor in it too. Are you serious? Yes. Where is he finding all this shit? I don't know. This sounds like a fucking con some ported blower on fucking spun to death and an LME fucking badass engine. Bro, we literally got two fucking street cars now. <laughs> oh, we're fixing to break this fucking thing. Oh, yeah. But well, we can fix it. Yeah. That's what I told him. I said, I said so what's the situation like if we go out and run it? And he's like, this guy, man, I'll pay for parts, you pay for labor. And I was like, perfect. Oh, fuck yeah, I just got me a Cadillac V. You're su you're out. <laughs> I, I got me a fucking COC, it's bitch, you're out. That's okay, I can drive this motherfucker anywhere. I can drive the fucking Corvette anywhere. He said you could, for sure, but it just doesn't get great fuel mileage. We're putting the fucking nitrous back on the goddamn COC. I'm telling you right now. Let me fix Bro, the tent first. I wait to pull up to the fucking red light in the middle of town and purge that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but uh, yes, but what I'm saying is he said with maintenance and a full operating expense, it's oh. roughly three hundred dollars an hour to run that plane oh, per yeah. year. Yeah. Come here. You know how Lucas? I was like, hey, I like this car, blah blah blah. He's like, yeah, I like it, but I, I'll just get another one. Look, he sent me two. He goes. If you like that one, let me know. I'll just go buy one of these instead. You can just keep that one. Oh, that's a two. Yeah. And then two door. And he's like, I like that one too. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? I don't even know. Like, this is insane. This is nuts. Hey, is the trailer reflective or no? I can't tell. Those are. Good? Yeah. Good.
You can see it in that because you can see the rainbow. I thought the black was the reflective type. I don't know. Yeah. Chinese. So, okay, so. Shit. <laughs> all right, explain. So, it's a methanol injected motor. So, basically, it cools down the engine, it correct? Cools, so, it, well, it cools the air charge. That's okay. It. So, supercharger. Yep. Air. It supercharges the air. Well, in order for it to work more efficiently, that air needs to be cooled, right? Because hot air is not efficient air. So it needs to cool the air down. So what it does is when it brings it in through the intake, it sprays methanol on it. Methanol cools it instantly and it runs cooler air through the supercharger. So basically when we go to It's the like track. making your own air system yeah. is what it is. Like, mm. yes, it's, it's so like with turbo cars, yeah. you, you understand this with turbo cars, mm -hmm. The more dense the air is and the more hot it is outside, the, the turbochargers are less efficient. Okay, okay, okay. When you got cool, crisp air, them son of a bitches will roll. Okay, yeah. I got, That's I got the same you. thing. So you're in a supercharger, you can make your own air. Okay. With a I've turbo, we can't speed. spray them in the front of the turbos. With a supercharger, yeah. you can't. I've so, got up to speed. That's the biggest difference. <laughs> I made all of that up, by the way. <laughs> I just thought that's what it was. I have no fucking idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> Cutting me. What y'all think the total gonna be? Y'all want to bet? 60 bucks. 60? 50? 58 dollars. 60. This is like Costco. I don't need a bag. We don't need a bag either, I promise. 62. You got a 62? I got 47. Ah, dang, wow. seven. Oh, Steve must be full. Mount it, pump it. <laughs> Come on, <he's> stupid. <laughs> We're gonna kick off the internet. It'd be hot. <laughs> hey, can the internet fire us? Tastes better than the